This is the uh, Lurrit right, Luigi 2000 back uh, with uh, Twilight Princess, and my brother is gone now, thankfully. <laughs> See you later. Alright. Remember that statue in Ronaldo's house? My name is Elvin. I am one of the light spirits of Hyrule. I am the spirit that guards these lands. Oh, great hero chosen by the gods, goddesses. The dark power you seek lies in the sacred grounds of the proud mountain dwellers. Look at that lava. But already those grounds have been defiled, draped in shadow, and seated with evil. You must go to these sacred grounds and cleanse them. Link? Oh, Colin. Ha ha ha, see that? I told you Link would save us. Yeah, yeah, pal. from Ordon, whom these children spoke of? Why are their heads so big? Well met, I am Ronaldo, shaman of this town. And this... is my daughter, Luda. Get out! Why don't you do an original? Go away! The beast took us, left us to die, but Mr. Ronaldo found us. Ronaldo. Fine, that's the more. Go away! Yeah. Oh my god. At first I couldn't believe they had come from so distant places or down a crowd. Yeah. We don't remember much, all of a sudden everyone was captured, and then, uh, until now, it's been like, a nightmare. Yeah, it's like a terrible dream, and we couldn't wake up. Hmm, nightmares are everywhere these days, it seems. The soul just certainly seen its share of the recent hardships. The, the Dark Beast attacks, and even worse, so it was a sudden and inexplicable change in the mountain dwelling Gordon tribe. They had long been our friends, but suddenly treated us as foes. Even now they refuse to permit a century to their minds. How can you tolerate that? Um, the minds of, I mean, it strains the limits of belief to think that such a gentle and proud tribe would change so suddenly. Makes me wonder if something in the, those minds is the cause of this change. In any case, you must take these children and flee this village before more nightmares descend. I, of course, cannot leave my village in such time. There is no telling what may happen to us here. You know, the children look way out of proportion here. I mean, look at Beth's head! Oh my god! Link's head is smaller than Beth's. Uh, that is my job to try and coax the Gorons back to the, from the recent change of heart. Uh, eh. 
Okay. But that's another reason why I haven't been recording, is because Andrew's lost his job and I ha have no chance of recording when he's not here. And as you've recently seen, he's annoying. I don't want to leave all these people just to save themselves. It's just Barnes and Luda and, and Renato here. Come on, Link, can't you do something? Isn't there some way to make up a Gorons? You think someone should go to the mines and do something? Hmm, is that a hint? Alright. Um. Can I go in here? Uh, well, I can go in here, but. Nope, not yet. Okay, so... Sky. Wait, where was that wolf? Oh, I thought it would appear in the graveyard. Climb up the snitting here. <laughs> oh, hey, dude. Ah? <coughs> uh, no humans allowed! These lands have belonged to the Goron tribe. The elder said, No humans may pass. is no match for the might of the Gorons. Do you understand me, human? They annoy with you! Mm. I guess we're not getting up there. So now we go down here. And yeah, meet with them. Ah, uh, how fortunate you are in one piece. I saw you heading up the mountain trail, so I was worried. Are you trying to reach the Gorons in Death Mountain? It's far too dangerous, Link. Hey, I'm Link. I go to danger all the time. They recognize only strength. A normal person would never persuade them. But I do know one person who was able to best them and earn their trust. His name is Bo. You may know him as the mayor of your hotel, or Ordon. Really? Please go to him, and while you're there, please let him know that the children are safe. Of course, getting them back would be best, but we should not. We could not keep them safe from the monsters on the road out of horse and cart. Please, return to Ordon and inform the parents that their children are free from harm. Give them my word. Oh, okay. It'll be a long walk back, folks. Uncanny ability to find us wherever we are. Okay, we're doing some ringling. Oh, 
And all of a sudden she's calm again. Hmm, you're not too shabby a wrangler after all. Won't this make getting back to town a lot easier? Yes, it will. Now go and finish here so we can get back. Get a move on. Alright. Now we have our horseback. Now this boulder. You may notice it looks bomb well, it certainly is, but we don't have bombs yet, so... also has the uncanny ability to find us. Uh, Greetings, Mr. Link. I have to come to deliver a letter. It's a letter from Oko. <laughs> <laughs> and he does the little treasure chest music. <laughs> well, my business is included. Onward to mail! <laughs> now, the freaky thing is, he'll yeah. run up to you even when you're a wolf. Okay, um... Oh, my head! Ah. Over here... It's a bug! How to mail pill bug. Bug fans love that golden color. Ch check out the hot bugs in the collection screen. Now, we can't use them yet. The cool thing is we can, uh... We can actually swing our sword while we're on up on it. And I'm not steering correctly because I'm too concentrated on swinging my sword. Anyway. And I know we have other bugs around here somewhere. Up on the island. Spirit, uh, 
sword, spear, whatever you want to call Alright, we meet again. You have a little more of the look of a hero than you did before. Do you are that? Do you feel ready to learn the next skill? I, I do. Very well. But before we begin, I must test you to ensure that you master the last skill attention. The ending club. Now then, come at me! Oh, I missed. Oh my god, how- Oh, it gets stuck. How in the world did I miss? Excellent. It appears you have certainly capable of performing me. My oh, last sorry. Very well. The second skill is... The shield attack. Let it be hewn into your mind. He's got like Darth, Darth Vader breath going. Hear that? No matter how well tempered a blade is, its foes clad in armor, it bears a shield. The sword will do it no harm. When facing such a foe, you must lock on with Z and thrust the nunchuck forward to thrust your shield against the defenses of your enemy. Use Z to lock on to me, then try it! You have learned much, so I am sure you will know the moment when you can do a shield attack. <laughs> Oh, no. There we go. Excellent. Open a hole in your enemy's defenses and lose your sword strike without hesitation. The shield attack I have just taught you can also be used to rid hell an enemy's projectile attacks. Would you practice? Then repel my magic attack with your shield attack. Yep. Oh. You must time it just as my spell hits your shield and reflect it back at me. Perfect. When your enemies assail you with projectiles, this is this is how you will defeat them with ease. Done. You have learned the second of my hidden skills with shield attack. Banshee. You have learned the second hidden skill. Shield attack. Puck onto a foe. Blah 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 blah. But I have five more secrets to teach you in time. The path to becoming a true hero is a long one, but once you have grasped all the hidden skills, I hear the ice cream truck, uh, you shall be worthy of walking it. You must persist on the lonely path of the sword to attain true courage and earn the strength to conquer the great evils of the world. Do not forget your discipline with the blade before we meet again. All right. Uh, that's about it for this episode, though. I'll go back into town the next episode. This episode, this is Silver Heart Lucky 2000, and I'll see you later.